March is National Theatre in Our Schools Month. We'll be sharing with you facts about school-based theatre. Yesterday we mentioned that administrators across the country overwhelmingly believe theatre arts helps improve student achievement. And for those who prefer only facts, Michelle Obama recently cited a study stating, quote, it is crystal clear. Kids who get involved in the theater have higher grades, higher graduation rates, and higher college enrollment. The annual THS Blood Drive, hosted by our very own Marine Corps ROTC, is tomorrow, so make plans to stop into the ROTC room in the back hall on the first floor between 8 and 2. Any student interested in trying out for cheer, there will be a short informational meeting tomorrow right after school in the teacher's cafeteria. If you can't attend, please see Ms. Granado for information. The tryouts will be March 13th through 16th in the dungeon from 5.30 to 7.30 with Monday through Wednesday being the clinic where you will learn the required material and tryouts will be held Thursday, March 16th right after school. If you're interested in information about Washburn University, a representative will be here next Thursday at 2.15 in the Cavalier Room. Remember, it's National School Breakfast Week. The cafeteria staff's invitation remains open for all Trojans to join the breakfast club. Having a good breakfast is great for your health, well-being, and studies prove that students perform better on schoolwork when they've had breakfast. Remember that they offer fruit juice slushes, and even newer to the breakfast club is their freshly baked donuts Monday through Thursday, along with those amazing homemade cinnamon rolls every Friday. You'll also find a hot breakfast option along with your breakfast classics of cereal and Pop-Tarts. And now to what you eaten. With a poppin'. A poppin'? Whoa! Really popped in here, didn't we? Uh, yeah. Hi, welcome to What You Eaten. Today for lunch we'll be having chicken and noodles. Or bean, rice, and cheese wraps. Or chili dog and chortles. And this week the cafeteria is featuring lettuce, which is grown right here in Topeka at Salem Farms. It's part of the Farm to School program. If you've never tasted the freshness of locally grown, now is your chance. And a side salad is only 75 cents, or you can make it a meal as a chef salad, you know, for 350. And if dressing isn't your thing, sodium-free seasonings and pico de gallo are available on the topping bar. Hey, if you're a baseball fan, or you're just into me, then you should check out my take on the MLB with Andy on MLB. You can see my take on the AL Central right here on this YouTube channel. And now we have a few messages from the Counseling Center. Seniors, caps and gowns need to be ordered and paid for by Friday. You can do this online at herfjones.com. Proctor and Independent Study Forms are due next Friday. Please pick up your form in the Counseling Center. Students can now sign up for AP exams. Each exam is $95. The deadline to be registered is March 25th by 3.30 p.m. You can see Ms. Bonshoff in the Counseling Center to sign up. Anime Club, please be sure to attend the meeting today after school in room 231. Tomorrow the BSU meets at 310 in room 223 and the Chess Club tomorrow in room 220D. Cheese? Cheese Club? The Chess Club, Andy. It's the Chess Club. Cheese Club. The Chess Club. We've said it a thousand times. It's and now a shout out to our very own Adam Cole, host of Tower Power Sports, who qualified for a state journalism contest in sports writing. And just in case you don't think your teachers here at Topeka High love you, for the third time in the last five months, Topeka High teachers and staff had the highest attendance rate. And that's all the announcements we have for you today, Topeka High. And remember, it's a great day to be a Trojan.